Hi everybody, welcome back to How To With Matt. Today's how to is going to be how to add subtitles to your video in DaVinci Resolve. So as you can see, I currently have a clip here in the timeline from a past video I've made. And what I want to do is add subtitles to this video. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come right over here. I'm going to right click, come down to add subtitle track, press that. That's going to automatically give you an option to add subtitles right here now. So I ha currently have the marker right here. I want to add a subtitle starting right there. So I'm going to right click, add subtitle pops up right there. These subtitles are by default three seconds long, but obviously you can increase or decrease the length to whatever length you want it to be. So once you add a subtitle, obviously you're going to want to change the text. So you're going to come right up here where it's automatically going to say subtitled by default. I'm going to change this to subtitle number one. And now when I play it through, it's going to pop up right here where it says subtitle number one, and that's your first subtitle. If you want to add multiple, what you're going to do is make sure once again, you're going to have the tracker right where you want the subtitle to begin. So right here, I'm going to right click, press add subtitle. I want this one to say subtitle number two. We're going to add one more. So add subtitle. This one's going to say, you might've guessed it, subtitle number three. So let's play through it real quick so you can see what it looks like. So subtitle number one is going to play through for three seconds. Then we have subtitle number two, and then it's going to move on right there to subtitle number three. So the other important thing to know here is so that you can add actual style to the text. So up here in the inspector, you're going to make sure on video, come over here to style. So then from there, what you can do is obviously adjust many things. You could change the style and the position. You could center it. You can make it left. You could zoom. You could change the opacity if you wanted to. You could add a drop shadow or take away a drop shadow. Add a stroke. You could add a background to the actual text. So there's a lot of different things you could do. What I'm going to do is just do one simple thing, and that's going to be add a stroke. I'm going to make it kind of a lime green color, so it's pretty visible. And then from there, I'm going to change it to, let's say, three, so it's very visible. So now you can see that adjusted, so it's much more visible. So now when I play three, you're going to see it has the same font and the same style. And there we go. And once again, you could obviously do many different things to the text to make it, you know, obviously your own. So once you completely finish your video and obviously added all your subtitles, at this point, what you're going to want to do is render and export the video. What you're going to do is come over here to the deliver icon on the right side press that. From there, what I want to do in this case, we're going to make it a H264 master. For the file name, I'm just going to make it subtitle. We're going to browse and find a place for it just to save. So come up here. I already have a file name, subtitles, press save. There we go. I'm going to come right down to where it says format MP4. And the important thing with this now is going to be since we have subtitles, we're going to come down going to go to subtitle settings. I'm going to press export subtitle. Then what we're going to do is come to format. You're going to have a couple options. It's going to be as separate file, burn into video, or as embedded captions. In this case, since a lot of people are adding videos to YouTube nowadays, what you're going to want to do is press as a separate file. And then from there, I'm going to usually use SRT. We're going to click on subtitle one and then add right into queue. Obviously you're gonna press render all once it's done. And at that point you're finished. And just like that, that's how to add subtitles to a video in DaVinci Resolve, as well as rendering and exporting it. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe, give it a like, comment below with any questions or comments. Also make sure to check out my DaVinci Resolve tutorial playlist, which you'll see here on the screen to learn more. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.